Ladies and gentlemen, we back. I right, smoke kick this thing out, man. Oh, you eat. San Francisco 49ers versus the Rams. This is going to be a good game. We're going to get to see um, with the 49ers defense. Um, see if they for real, for real versus the Rams offense. Now, the thing is about the Rams offense is they ain't clicking like they were last year. But I think that this is going to be probably the best offense that the 49ers have faced this season, though. And um, the 49ers look fantastic on Monday Night Football versus um, the Cleveland Browns. So with this game, it's happening in L.A. I think I'm going to take... I think I'm going to take the 49ers, man. I think the 49ers are going to continue to roll. I um, think the score is going to be something like 27-21. I'm taking the Rams at home advantage. I think their defense is still good. Um, I think they, like, they didn't look, like you said, they didn't look too bad against the Seattle like, hell, they only lost by one point. Like, I think they need to try to get Jared Goff to stop turning the damn ball over. If they can get him to do that, I think that, even though that the uh, San Francisco defense is pretty good as well. But I'm I'm, I'm going out on limb with the Rams. I'm going the Rams 32-24. Um... The whole Todd, Todd Gurley thing, man. Um, they were saying that he had arthritis in his knee, and that's reason why they yeah, believe they're playing not, him like that. Yeah, reason why they ain't giving him that many carries. But I'm like, don't they have other running backs? They drafted one, but I ain't seen him out there yeah, playing. Yeah, because it's like I understand that Gurley is injured, maybe injured some, but they just not running the football. They throwing so many ball passes out there. And their offensive line is not playing up to par as they did last year. And I think that's why their quarterback is struggling some. Um, But I don't know what's going on with Gurley. And they just gave Gurley that big contract. Because last uh, last week, they tried to future him a little bit. They gave him more carries early on in the game. But then they got into throwing the football because the game kind of got to a high-scoring game. But, um, yeah, that's the thing I want to see what happens with them with Gurley going forward because they need him to be that, that, that power back back there getting close to 25 carries a game. And this eight or nine carries ain't going to cut it. Mm-hmm. All right, people, hit that like button, subscribe, tell us what y'all got in this game, who you think going to win. 